The pressure is on, and opening game nerves can often take hold. Match day one for these two nations here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. Who will be first to make their mark on the group? And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner as usual is Stuart Robson. I'm excited to be bringing you match day one action at the Euros. It's Romania and they take on Ukraine. Well, it's vital that you don't have an off day in these group games. Consistency is key to progressing further in the tournament. I'm looking forward to a hard-fought contest here today, Derek. And the starting 11 for Romania. Well, they're playing in a 4-5-1 formation, which is set up to counter-attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. The opposition starting 11. Well, they're also going to play with a 4-5-1. It's now just a case of which side will play on the front foot and which side will sit deep. It should be an intriguing game, though. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, Derek, we know he's a good all-round finisher, but I think his greatest attribute is his heading ability. He seems to hang in the air, he's got great technique when the ball comes onto his head, and he usually hits the target. That's his greatest skill. Mudrik. That's a good pass. No let up here. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Alibek. And on to Stanchu. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Yorki Sudakov. Can they create something from here? In a dangerous position. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Yukim Konoplia. Hadji. Now with Stanchu. Could be threatening. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Sigankov. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Artem Dovbik. Mikhailo Mudrik. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress but quick thinking defensively. Hadji. And using his strength to shield the ball. Well, possibilities in the center. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Radu Dragushin. It's Marin. Andrei Ratziu. Razvan Marin. Ratziu. It's Marin. Andrei Burka. Yanis Hadji. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Man. Yanis Hadji. Marin. That is that for the first half here. You might. Away they go again. Second half is underway here.
He's very adept at protecting the ball. Options in the centre. Something to worry about here. Razvan Marin. Nikolai Stanchiu. Coman. And it took a little nick before it went over the touchline. So a throw in here. And a substitution in the offing. Banku and on to Stanchu. Dragushin. Chikaldao. Radu Dragushin. Andrei Ratziu. Chikaldao. Man. Good through ball. Chikaldao. Coman. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Konoplia. Zabarni. Viktor Tsigankov. On the ball, Tara Stepanenko. Romania doing well to regain possession. And into the last 20 minutes. Banku. Coman. And he could really get at the opposition. Good physical play. Could play it in for the lead here. That is a tackle and a half. Shielding the ball superbly. Well, no luck keeping possession. Well, can they nudge in front late on here? They're not giving the opposition a look in. That's strong play. Look at their supporters. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Dragushin. Burka. Banku. How can they find a late leveller? Timely intervention. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, it has come to nothing. Oh, what a save to keep them in front. Well, that should have been the equaliser, but it's 
probably a match-winning save from the keeper. Can someone get on the end of this? Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And that will be all for this game. Romania have lost the match. And that's the big story, Stuart. Well, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it, conceding so late on. Well, Stuart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.